Hello, DIY Glamettes. I'm Tammy, Glam Queen of DIY. Welcome back to the channel. And if you're new, welcome. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you five glamorous high end DIYs in a face off series. Now, if that sounds interesting, stay tuned. But remember to like this video subscribe to this channel turn on your post notifications let's get to crafting now for diy number one this is a vase uh up cycle now this tower bait vase i am going to be using my krylon aqua turquoise spray paint my crystal diamond rhinestone hot fix sheet my mirror mosaic towels and my crafter square diamond gems I'm going to paint these pieces and we're coming back. Now I decided to actually two-tone this face and I added that Miracal Silver Spray Paint from Dollar General. Now I have cut my diamonds and we're going to actually upcycle and decorate this face Glam Girl style. And again, everyone, this video today is part of a face off series against the Glam Princess of DIY. If you're not a family member of her channel, please go over and subscribe and let her know that the Glam Queen of DIY sent you over. And this portion of the video is a sponsored unboxing from Rose Forever New York. I received my package like this and it came in their package is always stamped fragile handle with care but i'm gonna let you see what they, we did get now let me tell you a little bit about rose forever rose forever is a new york based rose brand company that was launched in 2019 they specialize in designing luxurious flower bouquets and hand-picked exquisite roses that last for a year they use natural oils to preserve the roses and the boutiques are handcrafted by professional rose artisans their roses comes in round and square shaped velvet boxes and acrylic boxes and they come in three sizes 9 16 and 36 per box they are actually great for any home decor style now this box and these roses the look of the box is very gorgeous this is that luxury box the one that i ordered but Rose Forever also creates a diverse palette of roses with different shades. You can also get your blacks and your grays. And I'm telling you guys, I truly wish um, this camera had smell of vision. These roses smell amazing. Please make sure you check out my description box for that uh, discount code and Rose Forever New York website link. Now, everyone, let's get right back into the video. And thank you, Rose, forever for the sponsored unboxing. I'm just adding my mirrors down the side of my face. And again, everyone, please excuse my voice is going in and out. But this DIY is going to be so very simple that you can easily follow along with me.
Now this completes DIY number one. Let me know what you think about it down in the comment section. I'm just adding some roses to it so you can see how it looks with some florals. And DIY number two is a two-piece Dollar Tree candle holder set. I'm using two hurricanes and two stemless wine glasses. I'm using mirrored mosaic tile. I'm using also the crafter circle, the Dollar Tree jewel border trim. And I'm also using the crafter's borders jewel diamond trim as well. We're using the Krylon aqua turquoise and matte spray paint. And I'm going to paint my pieces and we'll be back. Now I have my pieces painted, you guys, and I did paint the inside of the base on these, and I'm telling you guys, this cork color is so gorgeous. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to add glue to the top of the Hurricane, and I'm actually using Dollar Tree's Fix All Adhesive. Always use the glue of your choice, and you guys, my I'm having an issue with my voice, so please follow me along and I'll give you instructions when I can throughout the video. Here I'm just adding my mirror mosaic tile to the center portion of my vase. You know I always try to conceal where my two pieces actually come together. And everyone, if you are liking these face-off series, leave me a comment down in the comment section so I can keep bringing them to you on a weekly uh, basis. And again, make sure you go over and check out Glam Princess DIY. Make sure you subscribe to her channel and let her know that the Glam Queen of DIY sent you over.
If you have not become part of this Clam DIY family, hit that subscribe button. Also smash that post notification bell, it'll turn blue. Make sure you have it set to all so you'll know every time that I do upload a video. And please make sure to look for my weekly content on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays at 5 p.m. and Sundays at 2.30 p.m. all Eastern Standard Time.
and this completes our DIY number two. Please let me know down in the comment section if you're liking this two-piece Dollar Tree candle holder set. I'm telling you guys, this uh, aqua turquoise color is so beautiful. And make sure you go over and check out Glam Princess DIY. And make sure you subscribe to the Glam Queen of DIY, the Glam Queen of Decor, and Glam Queen Unbox. Now for DIY number three, we're going to upcycle this Barcelona vase. So I'm taking this vase, I'm using my Crowlana Quad Aqua Turquoise Spray Paint, my Mirror Mosaic Tiles, and my Crafted Square Diamond Gems. We're going to paint this and we'll be right back. Now that I have my vase painted, I'm going to take that uh, diamond rhinestone uh, hot fix sheet and I want to lay it at the neck of this vase. So what I'm going to do, and I haven't pre-cut these pieces, but I'm going to cut my pieces so that we can complete this DIY upcycle. Now this diamond rhinestone Hot fix sheet is actually from bbcraft.com. I'm dropping bbcraft's information down inside of my description box along with my item discount code. Make sure you go over and check out bbcraft for some amazing crafting supplies. Now this face has a design on it. So what I'm going to do is I'm only going to trace out the stem of the mining because it has a floor design. So I'm going to trace out the stem of the mining of the flower to add a more detail to this face.
And even after adding the gems, and these are the Craft of Square Dollar Tree gems, even after I added these to it, it did heighten the elegance to the vase. But I promise you guys, if you got a vase just with adding that diamond rhinestone hot fix sheet around the neck of the vase, this piece truly did not have to have anything else done to it. But because I am extra, you know I had to do more. And to you guys, I actually had to stop this base at this point right here. I was out of gems and I actually was searching for these gems for about two weeks and still could not find them. So once we get them, I'm going to show you a clip of this once I finish doing all of the linings on this DIY number three project. Even though, let me know if you're liking DIY number three. Now DIY number four, we're going to upcycle these decorative vases. I'm going to take this large and these two small decorative vases. I'm using Miracal Silver Spray Paint and Krylon Aqua Turquoise. These mirror mosaic tiles. These are Dollar Tree Gem Border Stickers. I'm going to paint it and be right back. Now our pieces have dried and they look like this. Now, we're going to just do that small vase first. 
Now what I'm going to do first everyone is I'm going to take my mirror mosaic towel and I pre-cut my pieces and I'm going to wrap it around the neck of the vase. those Dollar Tree Craft the Square uh, jewels and I'm going to start by lining the bottom of the face and all I'm going to do is I'm going to take these gems and go around the bottom of the vase a total of four times. Now we'll keep repeating this until I complete it. And if you have not become part of this Glam DIY family, hit that subscribe button. Turn your notification button blue and make sure it's set to all so you'll know every time I do upload a video. And to my DIY Glamets, make sure to look for my weekly content on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays at 5 p.m. and Sundays at 2.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Make sure to DIY Glamets that you always check out my description box so there's always some very useful information there and please don't forget to subscribe to our other channels that's the glam queen of decor and the glam queen unboxing i truly do appreciate everyone's love and support This is what this face is looking like thus far. I'm going to add those same diamond gems two rows around the top of the face as well.
also DIY Glamettes, drop me a comment if you are enjoying this color series that we're doing for the fall so that I'll make sure I keep bringing you this type of content. Now this completes DIY number four. Drop me a number four in the comments if you're favoring DIY number four. Now for DIY number five, we're just replicating what we did in DIY number four. Now this uh, large decorative vase, I've spray painted it with that Krylon Aqua Turquoise. And this is actually matte. And I'm going to just add my mirror mosaic tiles and my Dollar Tree gems to it as well. So you can see here I'm starting with the neck of the vase with that mirror mosaic tiles. Now we're just going to jazz this vase all the way up because I want this vase to be a replica of that smaller vase. So follow me along as we jam up this vase. Glam Girl Style. And if you have not become part of this Glam DIY family, hit that subscribe button. Turn your notifications on, that bell will turn blue. And make sure you have it set to all so that you will know every time that I am uploading. And two, make sure you look for my weekly uploads on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays at 5 p.m. and also Sundays at 2.30 p.m. all Eastern Standard Time. Thank you so much family, old and new, for always showing your girl love and support.
And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you subscribe to Glam Queen of DIY, Glam Queen of Decor, and Glam Queen Unboxing. As you can see, we're completing DIY number five. Drop me a comment which DIY you have favored the best, whether it was DIY one, DIY two, three, four, or even this one, five. I hope you have enjoyed these DIYs. And if you've been rocking with your girl for a while, you know I can't close out without letting you know to 
always, always, always be positive so you can remain productive and stay positioned to make your next move your best move. I'll see everyone and you in another upcoming video. Bye everyone. Stay blessed and always stay positive.